Can I just say, this video was 13 minutes and 21 seconds long at the moment, and I, I kind of hate this video. I really do not feel like editing it anymore because it's just, I don't like it. But I need to post it, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut like most of the video out just so I can get you to the end of the video because that's, that's the good part of the video. I've gotten to the point where I just film something, it doesn't matter if it's cohesive, if it, you know? And then you come to watch it. So, okay, continue. I didn't plug in my phone. I was thinking about it, but I was laying there and I was so tired and I was like, I don't feel like getting up. Lo and behold, the power goes out this morning. I, I wake up and there's just no power. My mom and I got into a little bit of a an argument. My mom wanted to go out and get Starbucks and then just like sit in the car and charge our phones. And I was annoyed for some reason. I don't know what it is. I'm not PMSing. I'm not on my period. I'm not nothing. Like I am in the middle of like neither neither of those. I just for some reason yesterday and today I've been so annoyed for literally no reason. And so I was annoyed this morning when I woke up which kind of pissed off my mom. And then she got mad because I took her Charlotte Tilbury highlight and bronzer that really made her upset so then I was like you know what I'll just go on my own so I'm in my car I'm sitting at the Starbucks near my house um, letting my phone charge not to mention my phone is charging extremely slow I don't know what it is I don't even know how long I've been in the car I almost fell asleep like 10 minutes ago I like moved my seat down and I was like because, I mean, th like, it's so warm. I'm probably going to go home and get into bed. But also, I really need shampoo and conditioner. I also need glue to glue my uh, my magnet <laughs> onto my, my dashboard. It's on its third hand-me-down. Um, <clears throat> there's no horn. I don't want to go to Target. This is the first time in the last, like, six months I have not wanted to go to Target. Okay, do I go or not? I'm gonna call Andrew because he can help me make this up. Okay, I'm at Ulta and I'm about to buy some shampoo and conditioner. I also just took a hair quiz and apparently I have type 2A hair. Um, <laughs> and my hair's, my hair's straightened right now. I texted my mom. I apologized for me being annoyed earlier. She told me it was fine. I could just full lips, full lips look. Is that, we're just gonna do full lips. I got my sunnies. All right. Oh my God, I've always wanted to buy these. They're expensive. Oh my god, my car says that it's 98 degrees outside now. I don't think it's 98. Um, it does feel like it though. They didn't have a singular plastic spray bottle. They had them in like travel kits and stuff, but I don't need to buy a whole travel kit, so I need to go to Target to buy one of those. The reason I need it is because when I have second day hair and it's like all crusty and stuff or third day hair, I need to be able to like revive my hair a little bit and I need the spray bottle to spray water in my hair and then like scrunch it again. You know what I mean? So unfortunately, in this part, I had my AC turned on way too high, so you can't hear me at all. I think I was essentially just talking about my water bottle that I bought and how tiny it was because it was 99 cents, and then the Gorilla Glue, and then in the end I was like, okay, here's what I got, let's go home. That was my shopping for today, and um, that is it.
I'm scared to put the glue on my car. Cause I mean, it's a car. What if I have to take it off when we sell it? The thing is, no one's gonna buy this car. Go for the glue. Dang it, I forgot where I had taped. <laughs> no! Ow. Protect work area from spills. Apply a small amount to one surface. Press the surfaces together for 10 to 45 seconds. One, two, 43, 44, 45. It says on the back of that thing that if you put too much, it might not work. All right, here's where things start to get a little bit cray cray, okay? Up to this point, my day was really, like, there wasn't much going on. I was just doing my own thing, whatever. And then somehow, Victoria, her brother Anthony, and my friend Garrett, and Andrew ended up coming over to my house, and we all made dinner together. Actually, it was just Victoria and I. So I retract that previous statement. We hung out for a bit, and um, that was kind of chaotic. So here's that. It's storming so hard right now there's lightning and there's thunder and there's a lot of wind and andrew is not here yet but i think he's almost here and i was on the phone with him oh it's stopped raining oh my god Ugh. what is that run look who's here Put that told me it was gonna stop raining exactly like right when I got here, mm -hmm. and it did. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait! Don't shut it. Good day. Oh, it's over here. I'm cleaning the kitchen right now so we can sit and have a nice meal. How's everybody feeling? Storm. Excellent. Right, Victoria. I just scattered the food. Messed the man over there. It's vlogging. Out of the vlog. <laughs> walk around no, the camera. Put it at your eyeball. Yeah, just well, start walking. So enough of that. <laughs> Let's do that. How's your day, guys? Good. How's, how's it been going? Good. Yeah. How's it Yeah. Victoria. Yeah. I'm not. I don't think I'm a vlogger anymore. What? My my old vlogging days are over, Lauren. What are you doing, Andrew? Being angular. Uh, what are you doing, Victoria? <clears throat> Lauren, what are you doing? Garrett, what are you doing? <laughs> Anthony. Yeah. What do you like doing in your spare time? I like reading books, mm -hmm. self development, mm -hmm. self growth, you know. Educational. What would you like to be remembered about you? My. <clears throat> for my willpower. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what that word means, but for my willpower. Perseverance. Perseverance yeah. and courage. Yeah. Yes. What's your favorite Halloween costume? I typically don't wear one. I just. Mm -hmm. I go nude. Goes, yeah, <coughs> I get it. Anthony, what sports do you enjoy watching? Uh, WNBA. Yeah. What's your favorite team? Do you speak any other languages? I speak Russian. I, when has Anthony ever spoken Russian? I've. You're not fluent, are you? A lot. Yeah. But okay. What is your one annoying habit? Uh, spending too much time with Victoria. Mm. It degrades me as a person. Would you ever date a fan? <sighs> Probably. What's the weirdest thing a fan has ever done for you? I can't speak about that on camera. I get for it. For another time. I got it. Yeah. I've been there, done yeah. that. Do you like pickles? Out of the jar? Yeah. Sometimes. That's how we'll wrap this interview up. It was great. It was great talking with you, man. Nice meeting you. Nice, nice, nice meeting you. you. Yeah. <laughs> Keep back a little bit. All right. Hello, Andrew. How are you today? Yeah. I'm doing. I'm doing great. I'm so glad I'm that you great. could come down to talk with us this evening. Of course. All right, I've got some questions for you if you don't mind. That sounds great. All right, uh, as a kid, what were you like? I think I was pretty much a devil child. All right. My parents hated me, still do. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. fair enough. Uh, as a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? You know, I, probably, I wanted to be an astronaut. My parents told me at a young age that that wasn't going to happen, so I abandoned those dreams, and now I want to be a garbage man. Oh, garbage man. Uh, unbelievable. Solid dream. There's nothing wrong with being a garbage man. Okay. Did you have a favorite toy when you were younger? I think I like playing with my BB gun. Did you experience bullying while growing up? Of course. Oh. All the time. Oh, oh okay. Well, I got a BB gun in the first place. Oh, <laughs> uh, stay strapped or get clapped, I guess. Uh, where did you grow up? Um, pretty much suburban. Uh, what is the name of your favorite favorite teacher in school? Miss Thumper.
Wow. She was an inspiration. Yeah. yeah. The way her mind works, she was mm -hmm. an enigma. Can you define that word for us? Enigma? Yeah. No clue. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for coming down, Andrew. It was yeah, wonderful meeting you. Of course. I the face of the tortilla, and you she started slapping me. Did you? That happened to me, though. Well, who? He's like my other girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> it was you. Oh yeah. No, you. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> Are you gonna sit? Yeah, I'm gonna sit. If you ate all that, what would happen? I probably wouldn't feel so good. You wouldn't be able to play. I'm gonna die. Your lactate pill is in my purse in my room. <laughs> lactate. Wow. That's funny. What can you do? This is true. Wait. Yeah. Do you just like <laughs> How's the food look? No one's touching it. Oh, but my retainer case is over there.